Neil Blackwood is the baddest of the bad, I have to say. Um, I love that he's not part of, uh, he's not in the novels or the short stories because I spent a long time pacifying the purists who might be a little upset at the fact that their Sherlock is being re-examined um, by saying that everything does come from the novels or short stories, um, but Blackwood doesn't. So they were able to make him wildly evil beyond probably even Conan Doyle's expectations. I mean, the fact that he's, he's committed murders before the film starts, he's dabbling in the occult, he's in league with the devil. Um, it's, uh, he's a fantastically malevolent, twisted character, and as an actor, that's fascinating to play. Well, the first thing, he gave me a call and said that I want to become involved, and I just thought it was a brilliant idea because for the first time he'd be shooting something that he hadn't written. Although he was heavily involved in the rewriting as he went along, I always felt he should move out of what he'd been doing, because Lock, Stock, Snatch, Rock and Roller, they're all, they all deal with a similar genre. Uh, so I was, I was really excited he was going to get to do something different. Um, I love working with him, so I'd pretty much do anything with him anyway. Uh, but that's how that came about.